you stop being curious, you'll stop desiring to understand. And when we stop desiring to understand, that's when we slip back into that avoidance habit and behavior. So it's active. This is active. It's a lifestyle to choose to be curious, but it's a practice that has to happen time and again and again and again. I love the use of your word choice. It's a choice. Um, you know what? To love is a choice. Mm -hmm. To hate is a choice. Mm -hmm. And we are standing in a time in our nation where we all, all have the responsibility to make a choice. What will we do to engage, to learn, to be curious, to be proximate? Will we choose to not do any of that and thereby shrink our worlds? Or will we choose to be brave, to be courageous, and to recognize a shrinking world will ultimately disappear, but an expanding one matches the universe? matches the power of the universe and gives us opportunity to transform. How can we build more courageous communities? By courageous, we mean communities that are unafraid of the sometimes uncomfortable but necessary conversations we must have as neighbors and strangers to build a more inclusive future where everyone belongs. Join me, Jessica Green, and Reverend Dr. Zena Jacques, my co-host, on a series of courageous conversations in the countryside town of Barrington, Illinois, to explore what we're learning and unlearning as we invite our community to look inward and forward together.